Let's end this hour with the story of a new renaissance, black women in Hollywood. Not only are they creating some of the best shows on television right now, they're changing the game and opening doors and leaving them open for many more to follow. NBC News Now correspondent Zin Clay Esamoah shares their stories. My first TV writing job was on the reboot of Boomerang that Lena Waithe did at BET. I got my start in the industry uh, as an assistant at Girlfriends. I started um, Tracy Vaughn Productions, I guess a few years ago, and the whole goal of that, honestly, was to bring up new producers, bring up new writers, and employ women of color while doing it. Historically, the entertainment industry has withheld access and power from black creators. Movements like Oscar So White and Black Lives Matter have shed a necessary spotlight on these inequities. And today, some say there's a renaissance among black content creators and media moguls. Like these black showrunners, all powerhouses in media, paving what they hope to be an equitable and representative path in the industry. But this trailblazing is not without resistance. When I started as a staff writer in the business, it really was like there was one of us. If you were lucky, there was one in the room. It's hard to get shows on in general. It's hard to get shows about us on. I distinctly remember what it was like to feel kind of hopeless in this business and to even wonder if there was a place for me as a black woman creator. As more black creators take their place in the field, data show their presence opens doors for others as well. McKenzie and co found that films with a black producer or director are significantly more likely to have a black writer. And if a film's producer is black, the film is far more likely to have a black director too. Part of why we're seeing what we're seeing now is is the ones that were let through the door did not walk through it quietly. They went through it, they made their presence known, and then they held it open. I think black women do so much work in elevating each other. I remember when Grey's Anatomy came out, and you wouldn't have known because it wasn't like it was an all-black show, right, that it was a black woman. And like every black girl was like, you know that show was created by Shonda Rhimes, and you know she is black, right? Like it was just like that was the movement. And you just have this whole new kind of wave of creators that are making sure that you know who they are both behind and on screen and that's given you know so much more room for new voices to come in the door and as these black women showrunners take their seat at the table they hope to bring along many more we are all applauding the progress and we are all grateful for the progress but it is progress from a place of almost zero so even though it's been progress there is still a long way to go the evolution of the business of people seeing that Black people actually have stories to tell and there's money to be made. Black women have always been here. It's just now we're a little bit more visible and hopefully have a little bit more power. Our thanks to Zin Clay Esimov mm -hmm. for bringing us that important conversation. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.